Coach, what all contributes to a loss like this? First of all, you know, the Atlanta Hawks play a great, great basketball. I mean, I, you just got to give them credit. Um, um, they uh, they shot lights out. Um, they're the more aggressive team, more physical team. But um, you know that's first first thing off. I think I think they play great. I think on our end, uh, um, again when they made shots, uh, uh, we kind of put our head down a little. Then when they missed shot, they got their offensive rebounding. So the part where we didn't we didn't uh, uh, kind of. Uh, uh, toe of the line is our, our physicality uh, in the rebounding. And we knew they're an athletic team, a young athletic team. If we didn't put a body on them, they are going to hurt us. And sure enough, they did. So they made shots. They, they destroyed us on the glass. You guys have been playing solid defense for most yeah. of the month of February. That's, that's our identity. That's, that's kind of we're seventh of the league in defense, you know. And, and uh, you know, tonight we look like, you know, 800th in, in defense. We we lost our, our defensive identity tonight. Um, it's one game. I'm not going to, uh, um, you know, uh, 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 start changing things or, or go crazy. And, and, and I, like I said, I think they played a great, great game. Credit credit to uh, uh, Lloyd and, 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 and the Hawks. Is that a lack of communication on your end? Or a lot of times when people think physicality, they think on the defensive end, but their physicality on offense seemed to obviously give you guys. Yes, I think it was just both sides of the ball. I mean, they, they uh, uh, um, again, they're a very athletic team, uh, uh, and and uh, they just, they had the hit first mentality. They were the by far the more aggressive team. Can I, I imagine that at halftime, you must have had some issues with the first half defense, and then they come out in the third quarter and allow 40. Is, yeah. are, is the message falling on you? And deficits? usually... You know, usually our, our guys, you know, and again, guys, it's one game. Like, you know, our, our guys have been great defensively all year. Not good, you know, great. So, uh, uh, sure, we made some adjustments, and they came out, and they started hitting shots again. We start, we made some changes. Uh, when they started hitting shots, we start, you know, played some zone, mixed in, <laughs> excuse me, some box of one. Um, nothing worked. We threw the kitchen sink at them. Um, we tried our basic, went to other options. They, they hit against everything. Um, and then when they missed, like I said, they gathered the rebounds. So that big second quarter run, I guess from about seven and a half left all of the way to the end of the half. Karras was out that whole time. Was that just yeah. a matchup thing, or did he get dinged up at all? No, no. Um, you know, we wanted to. You know, uh, there's a reason behind it. We wanted to get him uh, uh, more minutes in the second half. Uh, we felt like uh, previously uh, we were putting him too late in, in too late in, in the fourth quarters. So it was a way to get his minutes back there and uh, uh, get him back at the end of the game. You talk about losing your defensive identity this game. Yeah. As a, a team, an overall team, you know, are you struggling to decide who you are these past three games, do you think? No, we know who we are. We, we no, we know this. I know the team. I know their identity. I know the guys. Um, you know, uh, uh, haven't played well enough. He's, he's had chances in two of them. This one was a, a, a obviously a blowout, and, and it happens in the NBA. Um, but I, I have I, there's no questions about our lineups or our guys or our our talent. None of that. Do you see any common thread in these last three games? Two different, two close games, and then a blowout. You know, so I don't, I don't know, you know, where there's commonality there. Um, every game's different. Every every game's a different animal in the NBA. Do you feel like there's a, a gear that you guys have not been able to get to, whether it's crunch time in the previous two losses or where it was in the first half, third quarter tonight? I don't know if it's a gear. I think it's you know, uh, in the close ones, we we didn't make the plays necessary, um, you know, to close the game out tonight. You know, uh, uh, we haven't been blown out in a long time. I mean, it, you know, you, you have you have games like this during the, you know during the season. It just happens. So um, you know that they had much more energy energy than us, and uh, uh, that's kind of the story of the game. Can you the challenges that the Hawks pose defensively? I think their zone defense is one of the best in the league right now statistically. Yeah, they've they've played a lot more zone. I think that helped them a little bit. We weren't great against it, um, but offense, we we shot like our offense. That that was not the that was not the problem tonight. You know, we we we, we got plenty of firepower offensively. Um, it was strictly a a, a def you know defensive breakdowns on our part that that, that cost us a game. With all respect to the three teams that you just lost to, I mean those are all. 
three losing teams, and now you've got Miami on the road and Boston on the road. What sort of sense of urgency do you have? I mean, there's there? a sense of urgency every game we play in, the, in this league, and, and was Boston or Miami, there is no easy games, and and uh, uh, um, it, 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 and it's going to be that way the rest. Of it. We knew this was going to be a tough, you know, tough schedule, you know, after the All Star break, um, and and we'll get it back. I have confidence confidence in the group. Uh, hey, listen, we've lost seven seven in a row. We've lost, you know, we've 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 gone through streets. You just got to get through it, and and um, and and get your juice back, and and uh, uh, you know, plow ahead. That's it's the only mentality you have to have. I think we talked about this before and how you balance defensive breakdowns with guys who don't typically knock down shots getting hot from long distance. So everybody made shots for them tonight. And as far as you keep saying, give them credit. Like, I mean, they, they made shots, uh, uh, and everybody made shots, the whole team. And, and and it went from, you know, until the end of the game. I think their, you know, their their second, third team came in and made shots. So um, you have to give them a, a ton of credit. Great game by the Hawks. Do you have any feeling that, that Jared Allen has struggled since the break? Um... I don't know if I'd say that. I think he's to the good and the bad, like everybody. Um, of course, we want him. We always want him to play more aggressively and and and, and dominate more. Uh, uh, but I, I wouldn't say I'm disappointed in him.